everyone, and welcome back to the new Drag Race. In season 2, Race 20, the same track as usual. Nothing else to say, because it's the same track as usual as always, so, yeah. Anyways, our first two driver field is running set to take on this race, and less, nothing else to say, so we'll just dive into the race, I guess. Right, Group 1 consists of Ryan Newman himself, Rocket Man, Kapush. Yeah, Kapush. Uh, Ryan Blaney and D Burrito, who managed to make it the booth in that Alka race. I'm not going to understand why, and I don't know how, but I'm guessing it's so. So, yeah. Let's get this race started, away, shall we? 3, 2, 1, and Sandy. And surprise, surprise, Ryan never won the race. But they credit Oka, both managed to get rid of him. So Ever three managed to get rid of him. And then Ryan and Sai just came back anyway, so. I mean, it, 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 I mean, they tried, they tried their best, but Newman came back to win, so, yeah. No moves on, the other three are out. Who's the price there? No one? Okay. Race 2 consists of Stuart Will. Into Dude, let's go. Avenue no Fred or Fried or Fast Pastor. Yeah, it's Fried Pastor this time. If I know that right. Go, go, Lugano. And Willie B. Byron. 3, 2, 1, Sendy. Then again, we're going to go through our extenders because let's face it, sure, it's not going to win this. And that was pretty close between After Fredo and um, William Byron, but I think Byron got a mention, but I really don't know. Lugano just. I don't know, tried to turn out for it, but it didn't work. And Truex, uh, he didn't really get off really well. Then again, he's very slow, so yeah. So it's going to be a radio between, um, well, fast past, fast past, and William E. Byron. Right, we're going to do a redo. 3, 2, 1, Cindy. I get it. I don't even know who won that race, so redo again. Fast past is leading out to his name right now. Quite literally. 3, 2, 1, Cindy. And fast pass to win the race, and um, will it be Byron is out? Remember the days when that car was winning races? Well, those days are over, it seems like. Next up, we got Cody Well. Great, here we go again with his wrecking streak. The credit one race of Kyle Larson and Ross Chastain, and then Daniel Suarez. Who cares? We're moving on because that's face as well. It's not going to win, but who cares? It's anyone's race, really. 3 2 1, Sunday. What the? <laughs> okay. I, okay, Cody Webb, well, he wrecked someone, so, I mean, I don't know what was that for, but Ross Chandler was winning, but I really don't know who won that, because, I really don't know, because I was paying attention to Cody Webb wrecking Chastain for stupid reasons. So, um, yeah, I, I think we'll just redo the whole thing, and yes, Flores gets to rejoin, because let's face it, he won't do anything anyway. I always been a close between Chastain or Larson, but Cody Webb, I've just paying attention to Cody Webb being Cody Webb, so, yeah, sorry about that. 3, 2, 1, Sunday. Okay, okay, now it's Kyle Larson wrecking Chastain. I, I, come on, you guys. Can, can we just race cleanly? First, we got Cody Ware wrecking Chastain. Now we got Kyle Larson wrecking Chastain. Everyone does not like Chastain today, seriously. And then it's well as well. You being as well as so. Let's face it, as well as out now. I beg to look. Can we just stop wrecking Chastain, please? Well, if he's done to you, like, what has he done to you today? 3 2 1, Cindy. Okay, yeah, Chastain won that race because everyone keeps wrecking him, so yeah. Look, well, let's face it, Chastain moves on, Larson and Cody Ware, keeps on wrecking them. Well, you can just, you can, you're out, you for two. Right, next matchup, we got Ryan Priest, the GOAT Ty Dillon, everyone's favourite driver, who managed to get seven next thing, anyways. Should have been first. I'm not playing. Mike McDowell, who cares, not going to do anything. And then Austin Ace Dillon. 3, 2, 1, Cindy. Ah, uh, Dillon, Priest, and... Why, McDowell? Why would you just wreck Ty Dillon like that? Why? This is why you're leaving, because now you're wrecking Ty Dillon the GOAT. How dare you? How dare you, McDowell? How dare you? And Priest, well, he nearly won, but... The Ace won the race. The, the highs and lows of Dillon brothers. Yeah, the, the ace, you know, the Ace moves on. Next match up, we got Cole Custard Cream, Tyler Reddit, Ricky Ikasik, Ricky Jr., who somehow starts second in the cut race today. I'm not gonna ask. And Bushy Bushy. 3, 2, 1, Sendy. And finally, Ricky Sashi moves on to the next round at last. Finally, it took him forever, but oh wait, he didn't want to race, but it's like the first one in a long time. He managed to move on to round two, so good for him. The other three, they were out. Next race is going to be a pretty fast one. We got Eric Jones, Christopher Bell, uh, Bill Wallace, and Chase Elliott. Well, nearly all fast, because let's face it, Bell's not going to win this. Let's see, let's just watch this. 3, 2, 1, and Cindy. And uh, it was Bubba won the race, so now we know Bubba going to win the race now, because let's face it, it, it he just illegally took a left turn. We're supposed to go right, not left, Wallace, and you, Jones, and Chase, well, he nearly won, so, and, uh, yeah, I tell you about, I'm not going to win, so, yeah. So, um, yeah, he moves on, and the other three are out, though. 
Next match, we got Danny DeRails, Chris, uh, Chase Briscoe, Justin Haley, and Eric Hammer Rowland. Yeah, because they, they actually finally managed to get the name for Eric Hammer Rowland. That's for his next gen now, and he has three Chuck Rick next gen. And his name is Eric Hammer Rowland. That, that's kind of an interesting name, but I'm not going to pay anything for it. Now we need to know what Kyle Busch's car is. Hmm. 3 to 1, Sandy. And what the heck was that? Denny Ham wins the race, even though he was crossing through all lanes and railing any second he had to win. Then again, he won the race anyway, so yeah, you have a freedom out, so um, yeah, I don't know what that race was. And for our final one, we've got Alex Bowman, Big Brad Brad Kazelke, Happy Harvick, and Chris Bush. 3 to 1, Cindy. And Happy wins the race, um, they pile up behind him though, Brad and Bowman have nowhere to go and just slam into him, and Bush, oh, he was close, but... At least we're going to have another Chris Bush going into round three again, which is a great sign to behold. So Happy moves on, the other three are out, even though they're piling into Harvick after the race. Neither drive move on, and surprise until Hendrick cars in this round, which is kind of surprising, because I haven't seen that in a while, that Hendrick cars move on. Fast pass to against the Rocket Man. I mean, they're going to be fast anyway, so... 3 mm. 2 one Cindy. And the Castle is going to be fried pass to moving on, fast pass to moving on. Wow, Newman's Alpha want. Shocking. Next up, Chastain vs. the Ace Dylan. 3 2 1 Cindy. And it's Chastain as they rub and bub across the line. Chastain barely gets Austin by an end, so Austin Dylan is out. This race depends on if Wallace is going to win the race or not. Because he's going against Dan Alves, and Dan Alves is literally the only fast car left. He's probably going to beat him, but. Mm. 3 2 1 Cindy. It wasn't even close. Wallace wins the race, and Dan Alves is out. Typical Dan Alves fashion. And in final race number two, we've got the two guys who pretty much dominated last year, Denny Hamlin versus Happy Harvick. So, um, I mean, we're now going to figure out who was better last year. Was it Hamlin or ha Harvick? It depends on all of them. 3 2 1, Cindy. Hamlin. He was better. Hamlin was definitely better because Kevin Harvick choked it again. Wow, how, how history repeats itself. How history repeats itself. Hamilton moves on. Harvick hits the wall and gets the DNF because he's out again. These will drive me on to the next round. I'm also kind of surprised that 42 cars some of my man's make it to round 3 or something. I don't know. These two cars have been shocking all day today. Let's see if one of them can improve and get to the final round. I mean, Fred Pass is looking, Fast Pass is looking to go and get to the final round, though. And Chastain might want to race already this season. 3 2 1 Sunday. And it's not gonna happen, but then again, I could tell you won that race, but I think it was Chastain by an inch, so. Yeah, but I, I really don't know, so I think we'll redo it. Play Coast Race, so we're gonna redo it for the Gillian of Time today. 3 to 1 Cindy. And this time it was Chastain. So yeah, Fast Pastor is finally out. At last, he's finally slow Pastor. Get it? No? Okay. Ah, bad dude anyway. The other three Chastain in the final will be two Toyotas. Well, well, you know, it'll be a Toyota, obviously. Duh. Well, I'm just dumb. Will it be Bubba Wallace, who is probably going to anyway, and probably win the whole thing now? Or will it be Denny DeReal, so he will find a way to develop anyway, so, yeah. 3 2 1, Cindy, I know it's going to win, but still. And Shock to Prox, Bubba Wallace is going to win the race anyway, so yeah, Denny Hamlin's out, he derails, yippee. So we have our final two drivers, it's Ross Chastain somehow in that 42 credit one bank car, and then we got Bubba Wallace who's going to win the race anyway, because, you know, he's just fast. Now you know why I don't race this car so much, because it's, when it gets to track, it's like 100% sure it's going to win anyway. It's like a 50% sure it's going to win. That one time as direct though. It could be a 99, I don't know. Anyways, in the 42 car we have Solomon Maca... Uh, yeah, you know who you are. And in the 23 we have Hendrick527 looking for back-to-back -back win, trying to do it again for once. Because he did back in season one as well with Chase Elliott and Noah Gojack somehow. And that's one makes wonder who will be. I beg to all that I need to do this race anyway, because let's face it, Chastain is not going to win it. It's going to be Bob Wallace taking an easy, cruisy victory, so, um, yeah. Only Chastain can find a way to choke this one away, which will win probably, but still. Wallace will probably win it by a mile, just by prediction, but still. He could find a way to choke it, but I don't see that happening. 3 2 one and Cindy. Uh, well, uh, he tried. He very, really tried, but it was not enough. He, he tried to spin him out, but... It was not enough. But Wallace gets his little fourth win at scene and finally breaking the tie of Austin Dillon. And well, Chastain, he tried, but it wasn't enough. It, it, it wasn't enough. I know you get, I know Cody well and last it to you, Chastain, but that doesn't say you have to do it with something else.
So yeah, I'm going to do that in the rest of the 23 team of Wallace won today's race. I mean, it was from the start. It was from the start when he beat that 43 in the 9 car. It was for sure that he was going to win the race by then. So, it was a clean shot after then. So, yeah. Anyway, so congratulations to Henry 27 on the victory against today. He is not done to the championship four race at the, in, the, in two weeks. So, um, good for him. He's going to need one next race now. So, good news for him. I mean, I would celebrate with Kurt Busch. But, I mean, Kurt Busch got out in round one. Rip Kurt. Anyways, guys, that was it for you. Make sure to subscribe, leave a comment below, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for the next re- I don't know, something I'm doing. I, you know what I'm doing tomorrow. Anyway, it's me, Steve Snivak. Sign out. Well, take a look at the later on today for the sign-ups as well, for the Kansas race. Anyways, congratulations to Bob Wallace and Henry from Trenton on the victory here today. So, yeah, bye.